Not yet, but I saw Mysterio. Raven's goon squad doesn't seem to be interested. Like, at all. And they must only want Tombstone. Thanks for the tip! Yeah. I'll keep looking for Harry. There's Tombstone. Seems to be holding his own. For now. Should give me enough time to mop these guys up. <laughs> Additional units are on their way. Hey, this is kind of hard. I have a shot. My balls on my motorcycle windshield. I'll squash you all. Breaking through that net! Never thought I'd see the day to defend me! You and me both, Lonnie! But these guys' his boss wants you dead! He's a hunter! And he's making super villains his prey! Guessing he's not open to a call for my parole officer about how I turned my life around. Since he's already killed Scorpion? Probably not! He suck me! Tired yet? Positioning.
sure do. Spider-Man? I know, I know. But first, what are those things coming out of you? I think it's my treatment. <laughs> Dr. Connor said it's some kind of self-learning exosuit, but I had no idea it could... Wait. You know what this means, right? We both have superpowers. Just think about all the stuff we could do to heal the world. Sorry. I uh, guess I still got to figure out how this thing works. Well, it's a real shame neither of us has a state-of-the-art science lab to run some tests. I'll go make sure the coast is clear. Meet you there. Give me a call when you're ready. what happened at Coney. What was that? Well, uh, remember my friend Harry? Yeah? That was him? How? Honestly? No idea. I think it's this treatment he's been... Oh, that's Harry. Gotta go. Hey, I cleared out the foundation. All right, I'll swing by. <laughs> swing by. Man, how many times have you said that in minutes, literally? That should work for Robbie. You gotta hand it to New York. I wasn't even trying to be funny there. If there's a good time to be had, they'll find it. on what was once a destination for enjoyment now stands desecrated and defiled. Our cherished Coney Island was victim to a free-for-all brawl destroying iconic attractions and history itself. Some of my fondest memories were Coney. Hey, you paid for that photo? I heard this guy dips his hot dog buns in tomato juice before eating them. Now... Hey! Are you crashing my 
my fighter? Am I crashing yours? Don't crash my prime, dude! Oh, you're done now! There's a problem with your VTOL! Let me take care of it! But I appreciate the assist. All right. But the next post-fight piece is on me. my talk. Today, we'll explore how to get sand everywhere. Gone. I wake up. That sand crystal is mine. Some 
kind of dungeon. Lots of empty cells around. You're not here. But are you okay? Marco must have felt so helpless. Trapped. With no idea where his daughter was. Come speeding through here at night. Is that a good photo, Spider Man? The Spider Man aren't the only superheroes in New York. Getting students to class on time? One of the greatest powers I've ever seen. I think I just saw one of Marco's sand crystals. We like our roads safe. Ish. Danicast clan, let's talk about Coney Island. First off, the latest news from first responders is many injuries, but no fatalities. Small blessings. But we have got a lot of unknowns. Who perpetrated the attack? Who was the man who helped Spider-Man? I've gotta be honest, folks. This is giving me not good flashbacks to the underground and rocks on brawls of last year. Here's hoping that with two Spider-Men in town, we can steer away from more citywide chaos. Here we go! They're really guarding this one! Crystal's all clear now. They say their boss is coming soon, and that he wants to meet me. I'm not waiting around. Sorry to break our promise, Kimi, but I'll tear this city apart to find you. Marco was worried Craven's people hurt his kid. That's why he blew up. Yeah, yeah. 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 
was taken to the raft before he could find her. I need to make sure she's safe. Maybe there's more crystals back by where it all started. Gonna have to flag that business transaction. Hey! Need a dance partner? I've been waiting for the pain! Trying to keep up with you.
I can't write speeding tickets. You hunters would be broke. the criminal who went to prison and came out a better person? Me either. But that's what Quentin Beck would have us believe. After his numerous crime sprees, <laughs> who could forget when he made Spider-Man look like a moron chasing an imaginary flying bus of school children while he made off with two million in diamonds. He finally landed himself where he belongs. Wait, behind bars. <laughs> Now he's out and wants us to accept him back into society as a fully rehabilitated. We have to get Spider-Man! If you're looking for $2 bills, I think the bag on the 101st has some! guys at least try to have a plan next time gonna get that last hit.
it in. Ah, hubris. It defeats us all. data I pulled from that base was right. This is a hunter blind. Maybe I can learn if there's another base nearby. What's wrong with you? Nighty night. Uh-oh. You don't look like you were expecting company. End Consider those hunters hunted. I should look around. Let's see if this thing really does have a bird brain. <laughs> a map of a base. Think I can dig around to see what's waiting for me there. Disabling its relay won't let them call reinforcements. Good to know. Two other blinds. You've been getting around. I have to search the other blinds in Harlem until I find out where the base is. We're suffering through a litany of problems right now. Inflation through the roof. Feckless government officials, and a country on the brink of a collapse not seen since the fall of the Roman Empire. Yet the worst, most insidious dilemma we face is that of the faceless. It seems another masked vigilante is bringing their illegitimate justice to the streets. All reports indicate an individual disguised in purple and sporting a take-no-prisoners approach to the illegal activities they perpetrate. Some of you have criticized the Spider-Man for not going far enough. But I can't believe what I'm saying. That's not in their jurisdiction. While they shouldn't be out there in the first place, at least they haven't sworn themselves as judge, jury, and executioner. We have systems in place for this people. 
if this new hero really wanted to enforce his order to the fullest extent of the law, they'd join the police department. Why is it so hard for some people to follow the rules? This is the chaos the Spider-Man inspire. And why must I be the sentinel of statutes? Now, how about that? Seems like everyone has a robot army but me! Wasn't too rough.